Hey, so I just wanted to let you know about a couple of really cool features we released last week. Um, so the first one I'm going to show you is uh, the advanced leaf lead flow rules that we've added to Follow Up Boss 2. Um, so basically what you can do now is when you come to your lead flow screen and you look at the particular lead source, you can actually go into advanced settings here. Um, and we're now giving you the ability to use zip code, price, MLS number, and the existence of a phone number to decide who gets which lead or which action plan should run for you know leads that, uh, that match the criteria that you set up. So uh, basically what we do on every single lead that comes in, uh, if there's a zip code included, is we add that as a tag to the lead. So that's going to allow you to just basically put in that zip code here, and then you can ultimately decide uh, who gets which lead um, you know, from that particular zip code. Uh, you can also have multiple conditions, so if you wanted to include a zip code and a price, for example, um, you can very easily do that here. Um, a big part of this update is also the ability to route based on MLS numbers. So you can put one or a series of MLS numbers, so if you're wanting to be able to route leads um, off of a, a listing that's owned by a particular agent, you want to send them all the buyer leads that come in off of it, uh, you can now pretty easily do so in Follow Up Boss. Um, the other thing that we've added is the ability to actually do a very specific price point, which can also help with routing uh, leads off of um, a specific listing as well. Um, you can have multiple leads for every single lead source, uh, and you can have multiple conditions for every single rule. And as always, you can uh, choose, once you set the rule, you can choose to assign those leads to a specific agent or to a group of agents to have them distributed by Round Robin. Another uh, feature that we released as part of this as well is the ability to copy lead flow rules from other uh, lead sources that you've set up. So if you go ahead and you put in all these different rules and you want to actually apply similar rules to other sources of leads, um, so for example, if you set up Zillow and you want all your Realtor.com leads to follow the same uh, rules, you can just hit this button uh, to hit copy rules from another source and then you know you can basically just select whichever rules are in that lead flow source uh, that you want to add and just hit copy um, to see them show up so that's going to save you a ton of time once you set them up you can basically just copy them through to any other lead source that you'd like to have another part of this is also that we uh, we've added the ability to actually see who's up next in the round robin distribution so you can very quickly come here and see who is going to be the next person to receive a lead it's a question we get often to not understand where you've where you're at in the rotation in a particular group. Uh, so this is the way to, uh, to be able to see that here now through the group screen. And finally, we also released a bunch of uh, updates, just sort of usability updates to the people screen. Um, so now uh, the way it works, uh, what would happen before is if you clicked on, if you created a filter and didn't necessarily save it as a list, if you clicked on a lead in that list and then wanted to hit the back button to come back and see the same list that, you know, with the filters you created, unfortunately, those would all be reset. Right. So what we've done is now we've made it so that once you add a filter to a particular list, uh, you can click on a lead here, um, you know, do anything that you'd need to. And then if you just hit the back button, you'll see that this uh, particular uh, filter has been saved here for me. Um, the other thing that we've done is we've made it so it's really easy for you to initiate phone calls and texts right from the people screen. So now what happens is if I click that phone icon, you'll see that the number will actually, you know, the I'll actually start dialing the lead immediately. Of course, this is if you've got the, the integrated calling feature enabled. Um, so those are some really exciting things we brought out last week. There's also a ton of other stuff that we've done that's sort of you know more hidden or in the background. But uh, if you've got any questions, suggestions, or updates, um, please feel free to reach out and let us know.